Good morning. Today is May 29th. This is Trish with Australian Labradoodles Midwest Connection and I'm doing a video, making a video here of Cooper's litter of 10 puppies and I'm going to try and do this and uh, get through this with showing each one of the puppies. All of the puppies except three have been adopted and I'll show you the three that are still available and um, they will be gone there I just posted it to my website and uh, I can say within 24 hours they'll be they'll be sold so I just if you're interested in one of these puppies call me ASAP the phone number to reach me is 262-628-3522 um, usually within 24 hours if I have any puppies available after a litter they're gone so that's just how it is. So I'm going to, like I say, go through these pups one at a time and show you each one and um, tell you the names of them if there's some that already have names. So let's see here. I'll start with this one way on the side. This is Dilly. D-I-L-L-Y. This is Dilly. Dilly is a female. She's been purchased. Well, she's been spoken for. She's already been named. This is Dilly with the violet collar on. That's Dilly. Little white splotch on her head. And uh, these puppies are three days old. They were born on May 26th. So Mama's checking out Dilly there. Okay. Um, let's see. The next one is Coco. Coco is another little one of our little girls. Coco has this uh, the steel gray collar, which is right here. This is Coco. Beautiful, solid red pup. That's Coco. Okay. Uh, the pink collared girl. This is Callie. C-A-L-I. This is Callie. I'm gonna pull her off of the teat she's been nursing on here. She's not real happy about that. But that's Callie. Beautiful, nice head, nice stop on this pup. All these puppies have fleece coats. They all have beautiful stocky bodies um, and nice stops, which are the noses. That's Callie. Mama's kissing Callie up here. Okay. Um. This dark collared green, Kelly green collar, is actually my aunt's puppy. And uh, so this is her puppy. She doesn't have a name for it yet, but she knows who she is. <laughs> I'm her goddaughter, and this is her puppy. This puppy's going out to Arizona at some point. Green. Kelly green collar. Mama's cleaning him, her up nice. Beautiful stop. Nice square head. Very alert. Darling little puppy. So that is going to my aunt. And uh, this gray puppy, if I can grab him, is Duncan. Dunk for short. That's Duncan. Beautiful. Look at the nice dark colors on him. Can tell Dublin is the father. These are such stunning puppies. I'm going to have beautiful straight fleece coats like Dublin. Beautiful dark reds. Just stunning puppies. 
So that's Duncan or Dunk. Dunk for short. Mama's licking him up. And the other one that is spoken for is the lime green puppy. Right here. He was just sold this morning. This is one of the four that's just quickly been purchased. The lime green puppy does not have a name yet. This is the little boy. Deep dark red coat. Beautiful. He's looking for a teat. He's kind of nuzzling my hand. That's this little boy, the, the green collared puppy. Lime green collar. So let me try and go through the rest of them now. Um, the light blue right here. This little boy is available. He was just nursing. Gorgeous puppy. Beautiful stocky body and a great square head. Nice stop. He is still available. Light blue. Collar. If anybody's interested. And... Uh, who else do we got here? Aqua. Aqua's right here. This big chunk is available. Beautiful aqua collar. Uh, beautiful puppy. Aqua collar. He's got a little white splotch on his forehead. Nice square head. Very beautiful shaped head. And a very stocky, healthy puppy. I can't get over how they've grown in three days. They've like tripled their weight. They're just stunning. Or tripled in, in uh, just in size. It amazes me. So this boy is available yet. Very calm disposition. That's the aqua collar. And the last one that's available is the orange collar. And that's sleeping under her leg here. I'll have to untwist his collar when I'm done here. But this is the orange puppy. Orange collared puppy. Beautiful puppy. And um, I can fix that when I'm done. But he's got a beautiful red coat. He's probably the smallest of the three that are left. But he'll probably be 29 pounds or so when full grown. The rest of them will be um, between 28 and 30 pounds, 32 pounds to 33 pounds, right in that range. So that is Mama Cooper and puppies. Cooper had a nice bath this morning, so she's feeling so much better. Puppies are doing fantastic. You can see the little cord here. I have a heating pad underneath right where the puppies are laying, right here. And so they're all toasty warm and you have to regulate their heat at this age and keep them always warm, no drafts. So Mama's just doing super with them. And as you can see, like I said earlier, she nurses some of them and then some of them sleep. So it, she just does it in a cycle. It's amazing how this works with nature, but that's what's going on. You, you see the, uh, the couple of them bumping their heads up and down. They're nursing over there. And then uh, the lime green one is sleeping as the rest of these are sleeping in front here. And that white collared puppy right there, I'm not going to take it off of the teat because nur she's nursing so nice. That I'm holding back for my Guardian program, and uh, she's a beautiful, stunning red pup. If anybody's interested in my Guardian program and they live within 30 minutes of me, I would love to hear from you because I'm looking to find a home for her. There's a section on my website that explains my Guardian program, and in, in essence, you end up getting the puppy for at no cost but I have the breeding rights to her I would end up getting four litters of her puppies during her earlier years I also don't breed them for the first time till they've had their second heat cycle because I feel they're too young otherwise and uh, by the second time around they're more mature in their head 
their bodies aren't mature, but they're not ready yet to be a mom. So I wait till their second heat cycle. So if you're interested in any of the boys that are left or a future pup from one of my future litters, go to my website, click on the Contact Us tab at the top, send me a quick little email, and I'll send you back my introductory letter and my puppy application to start the process. And that's how you would adopt a future puppy from me. And I'd also send you um, what's called my introductory letter, and that explains my whole program to a T. So you, probably any questions you would have are answered in that document. So hope you have a terrific week and enjoyed this first video of Cooper and Dublin's babies. Again, these are three days old. There's ten of them. She had five boys and five girls. Thank you.